very excited for the stream today. We got a cycle of three new games this week. We got... This music. <laughs> we got you right with Chugs. So you better follow. <laughs> is the music in this game going to be... Is that Zelda? Oh, that's so pretty. There we are. Rise, Link. The time has come for you to awaken. You are fated to have a hand in a great destiny, and it will soon find you. The time has come for you to awaken. Link. Intense, pretty intense intro. I don't know what happened. I think Link just woke up. I think. Hey, sleepyhead. I know how much you like to sleep in, so I'm guessing this letter will be your alarm clock this morning. Are me and Link the same person? I love to sleep in. I love to sleep in. <laughs> Rise and shine, Link. Today's the wing ceremony. You promise to meet me before it starts. Remember? You'd better not keep me waiting. Zelda. Okay, we won't. <laughs> Why is this song so sick? <laughs> Game over. You found a blue rupee. It's worth five rupees. Better drop it in your wallet for now. Oh, sweet. Okay. Let's see what's going on here. Let's see what's going on here. Yeah. Morning, Link. Pippet is this guy's name. So, today's the wing ceremony. Are you ready? All I'm saying is everyone else is out practicing at the plaza, but you seem pretty relaxed about the whole thing. Of course, that crimson loft wing of yours is something special. I'd feel pretty confident riding him, too. My bird won the last ceremony, but even I don't think he could beat that red terror of yours. Of course, a bird's true speed in a race always comes down to the skill of the rider. I'm something of a bird researcher around here. So you know, if you ever find yourself in need of some bird expertise, come see old Pippet. Yeah, I want expertise. I'm letting you know. If I have to race, I want to know what I'm supposed to do. Okay, I will go this way. Oh. Always dive from a designated diving platform when mounting your loft wing in Skyloft. Okay, this is cool. Who's, who's this? It's Pikachu! It's Clefairy! Olan. Hey Link, the day of the wing ceremony is finally upon us. It's time to put what you've learned to use. All those practical skills I taught you, and all the academic prowess instructor Corwell taught you. While we're at it, do you remember how to look around using up? Press up when you want to take a look around at your surroundings. Yes. Yes, I do know that. What's this guy doing? <laughs> Fledge. Good morning, Link. Today's the big wing ceremony, right? I wanted to fly too, but I, I didn't make the cut, so I'm stuck back here at the academy. Plus, I've got to move these barrels over to the kitchen. I was hoping to at least be able to cheer you on, Link, but I guess that's the way it goes. Go out there and wow them, buddy. Well, can we help Fledge with his barrels? Can we help him? <laughs> oh! Wait, maybe I can help him. 
I don't know where I would want to put these. Can I pick up this thing? No, I can't pick that up. I'm not like you, Link. I fail at everything I try. Fledge, stop it. That's why I'm still here practicing picking up barrels with A. I guess it's not all that. I guess it's not all bad. At least I'm getting paid. Poor Fledge. Aww. Oh. We can sit. You're too late for breakfast. We stopped serving hours ago. You'll have to wait for lunch. Okay. So I missed breakfast because I slept in. Oh. Let's talk to... Henya. Where in the clouds is that Fledge boy? He's supposed to be bringing me barrels. He's trying. He's trying real hard. Sometimes I just don't know what's going on in that boy's head. Hey, be easy on him. He's trying his best. I wonder if I should go out here or go upstairs. Oh. This song's cool, too. Skyloft. Okay, it looks like I want to get up there. But, okay, before... <clears throat> excuse me. <clears throat> before we continue on, I do want to run upstairs and see if there's anything up here. Because I didn't explore here yet. Hey! Link. If you're heading over to the plaza, the quickest way is out the door on the ground floor. The exit on the top floor is still locked, so you obviously can't get out there. <sighs> What's taking the lunch lady so long? I'm going to have a word with her later. But can I still explore here? I'm just curious if there's anything to explore. And who's this? Hi. Corrine. Good morning, Link. Good luck in the wing ceremony today. Just think, if you win today, you'll become a senior like us, and you'll be able... And you'll be a very big step closer to graduating as a knight. You'll even get a knight's uniform like I'm wearing. Something tells me you'll be pretty handsome in it. <laughs> Is that so? They hitting on us a little bit. Corain, but still not as dreamy as him. Oh, why are we still here? Man, there. Who's she talking about? Bird statue. Oh, we can save. Okay. There's a bug. Okay, I can't do anything. Can I exit through here? No, I can't go through there. Hey! Or well. Hey, Link, up here. Yo. Good morning to you, Link. Today's finally the day of the long awaited wing ceremony. Are you feeling ready? Oh, I just remembered. There's something I, I, I would like to ask you about. Target me and we can have a quick chat. Ooh. Excellent. Always remember you can target someone to talk to them easily. And even when there isn't anything to target, it's a convenient way to quickly face your view forward. Oh, but it's a little silly to carry on a conversation from this distance. Why don't you come... Why don't you come join me up here? <laughs> Oh, yeah, we literally run up. Okay, but how do I jump? Oh, I just automatically jump. Okay, cool. So, what are you up to? Rushing to get some last-minute bird racing practice in this morning, Link? Oh, you have someone to meet. Ah, Zelda's waiting for you, is she? Our girl Zelda. Our girl Zelda. Uh, perfect timing, then. You see, Zelda's father, Headmaster... Gapura has a pet named Mia, and well, she scampered off again. Look. Look, over there. Do you see her? The headmaster is so busy working with Zelda preparing for the ceremony. I thought that maybe I should feed her, but the ceremony is about to start, and I just put on a fresh set of clothes, and well, you see. Will you help me out and go retrieve Mia for me? Of course. We're on it. Ooh. Fantastic. So you'll do it? I know you're in a hurry. So I really appreciate you taking the time to help. You should be able to climb up somewhere over there. If you hang off that ledge there, you can climb onto the roof from the other side. I'm terribly sorry, 
but I know you're quite the climber. I really do appreciate it. Okay, amazing. If you dash at the wall from there, you'll be able to hang from the edge. Do be careful when you're hanging off the ledge and keep an eye on your stamina gauge. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh, that costs stamina. We could probably push this, right? Yeah. Yep. There we go. And we rescued him. Oh. Look at him. Look at him. Can I go from here? Yeah, it is. Okay. Nice work. You brought her back safe and sound. Please tell the headmaster that we found his pet. He should be up by the statue of the goddess. I'm trying to find Zelda right now. I believe Zelda spoke too soon. You want to go? You want to go, cat? Huh? Huh? What is this? You got a stamina fruit. This peculiar fruit replenishes your stamina gauge. Okay, but how do I use that? Bruh. Fruit? Ooh. Morning, Link. How's life? Did you manage to get even a wink of sleep last night? No. Uh, figured you might have been tossing and turning all night thinking about the big ceremony today. Yes, we are. Okay. <laughs> a prayer in time saves nine. If you know what I'm saying. No, I don't know what you're saying. I'm just going to talk to Zelda. There she is. Look at him. Look at him. There's Zelda. Hey, good morning, Link. I'm glad to see my loft wing got you out of bed. I was pretty sure you'd sleep in and forget to meet me this morning. <laughs> but look at this instrument, and look at this outfit. They're mine to use today in the ceremony, since I'll be playing the role of the goddess. Aren't they beautiful? Especially this instrument. They tell me it's just like the one the goddess was said to have in the legends. It sounds gorgeous, too. I asked father about it, and he says it's called a harp. <laughs> and look at these clothes. I made this wrap myself, and we get to use it in today's ceremony. I love Zelda. Like, I love the Legend of Zelda. I love the game franchise so much. Uh, between the harp and this outfit, I'm going to make a great goddess today. Yes, you are. I got you up early this morning because I wanted you to be the first to see me like this, Link. Oh my god, they're in love. They're in love in this one, and I love it. So, how do I look? Great. Ha, I think so too, but it's nice to know you agree. Thanks, Link. Ah, there you are, Zelda. Are you all prepared for today's ceremony? Oh, hello, Father. Uh-oh. Ah, Link, you're here too. Outstanding. It's encouraging to see you up so early, given your capacity for sleep. No doubt today's ceremony had you too excited to close your eyes for once. If you win today's ceremonial race, you'll get to participate in the post-race ritual with Zelda. So give it your best out there. I'm worried about this race. I've never raced before. Yes, about that. Father, I don't know if he can do it. Recently, Link hasn't been practicing much at all for the ceremony. Zelda just calling us out. Zelda just calling us out. <laughs> And even when he's out riding his loft wing, he's just lazily gliding around, probably daydreaming. I don't know what he's thinking. He's going to have to be in perfect control of his bird to win today. No need to worry yourself, Zelda. Though you may have a point, today's wing ceremony tests the skill of the rider as well as his bond to his bird. Victory will not come easily. 
And, as you pointed out, I haven't seen him practicing as hard as some of the other students. But you've known him since you were both very little. You should know better than to fret about him. You see, Link and his Loftwing share a special connection. I've never seen anything quite like it. As you know, each of us in Skyloft is but one half of a pair. We are only made whole by our Loftwings, the guardian birds that the goddess bestows upon each of us as a symbol of her divine protection. So we're like in the sky, which is cool. When we are young, every one of us meets our Loftwing under the great statue of the goddess. It's quite a big moment, as I'm sure you recall. Ah, but that first meeting between Link and his Loftwing was very extraordinary. The bird that came to him was a crimson Loftwing. It is a breed so rare we were sure for some time that it had vanished from the line. Yes, and the boy and his bird seemed to share a profound connection from the moment they met. Do you recall when Link and that Loftwing of his first met? What a sight. The little boy just hopped up on that bird and gracefully flew away without even a moment of instruction. They were meant for each other. And judging by how jealous you were that day, I'd say the friendship he shared with his bird didn't go unnoticed by you, my dear. I'm excited to meet our Loftwing. Very excited. Ah, but, but who can blame you? I'm sure you weren't the one, the only one envious of the powerful bond shared by Lincoln's bird. Anyone who is part of something special is bound to catch some nasty looks sooner or later. Ho ho. <laughs> this music is great, by the way. It's great. And Ninja, thank you for the hundred. I appreciate it. Oh, I skipped over it. I didn't read it. He said something about nothing to laugh at. Uh, now it's saying, if Link doesn't fly fast enough during the race, what if Link messes up his big chance? What if he's not allowed to become a knight? Ooh. Calm down, my dear. It will be fine. Honestly, it's almost as though you became or become a completely different person when you worry about Link. Yeah, because she loves us. She loves us. Hey! Listen, Link, you'd better fly your heart out today. At the very least, you need to squeeze in a little practice time before the race. <laughs> Come on, you'll thank me later. Good, I want some practice. Some practice time would be great. Here we go, or here we are. Go on now. Jump off the edge and call your loft wing. It's almost time for the ceremony. So try to practice seriously for once. Hmm? Oh yeah, you can't sense your bird out there? Oh, I get it. You're trying to weasel out of us having to practice. Nice try, but you're not fooling me. Off you go. Okay, Link. Go ahead. Press down on the D-pad. Can you imagine Link just dies? This is the end of the game. Zelda just killed us. <laughs> Hmm, this bird sure is taking a long time. Something's wrong. Yeah, where's our loft wing? Hang in there, Link. I've got you. Oh my god. I'd be so mad at Zelda right now. Just chucking us off the edge. <laughs> where's our loft wing? Ooh. Are you two all right? I'm sorry, friend. I didn't mean to push you so hard. You didn't sprain your wing, did you? This is very odd, Link. What could have possibly happened to your loft wing? For a bird to ignore the call of his master, it's unheard of. And you still can't sense your bird nearby, eh, Link? This is quite a problem, especially considering the wing ceremony is about to start. Link, when you said you couldn't sense your loft wing, well, I should have believed you. I'm sorry. Yeah, you almost killed us, Zelda. I need to tend I need to tend to my own loft wing, so I'll catch up with you later. You'd better go on ahead and see if you can find where your bird has gone. Yeah, we should. We have to find where our loft wing is. Ooh. Ceremony's about to start. Bye. 
How did it get to be so late? If I recall correctly, this year, Instructor Horwell is presiding over the ceremony. Link, you should go explain the situation to him and see if he's willing to delay the race a little so that you can find your bird. Thank you very much, Liddy. <laughs> but Father, you're the headmaster of the academy. If Link asks Instructor Horwell, he'll probably just come talk to you about it. Ah, quite true. As usual, you make an excellent point, my dear. Very well. I'll explain the situation to him myself. Link, run along and tell Instructor Horwell to come see me in my quarters. Okay, so am I going... Hmm. Don't worry, Link. I'll be sure to explain your predicament to Instructor. Go find him and ask him to meet me in my quarters. While we chat, why don't you go ask some of the other students about your bird? I seem to recall a few of them were gathered near the plaza. Down at the south of Skyloft, that place with the X marks, X mark is the plaza. We'll be holding the wing ceremony there today. Okay. Mm. Have you read a map before? You can press select at any time to see a map. Okay. But what I'm curious about is... Oh. I wish I could get it. I wish I could get the bug. I don't know how to get the bug. Your loft wing is missing, but I just saw him. Gross's bird was chasing off after your feathered fella. Uh, I think, uh, well, to be honest, I don't really know where they went. Where's, where's he at, though? Oh, Bruce and his little cronies were saying they were headed down to the wing ceremony in the plaza. So my guess is they might be in the plaza. Normally, the fastest way there is just down this path, but this gate here still needs some work before it'll open. Can you go around through the academy? Remember to check the map. Okay. Okay. So let's go down. This is all new for us. Okay, I could go down that way, and that's probably where I'm going to go, actually. But I thought I saw an interesting item. Yeah, this. You got a heart. This item... Life-giving energy restores one heart of life. Okay. Yep, this is our guy. I think we found him. I think we found him. You know, Groose, that sure was a pain. What with all the scratching and pecking. <laughs> this guy's got to be a bad guy. Of course it was. You thought a big crimson loft wing like that was going to go down without a fight? But we got him, and I don't care how tough those birds are supposed to be. He's not getting out of that pen anytime soon, boys. He took our loft wing? Whoa, Link, so, uh, yeah, just how long have you been standing there? Give us our bird back. What's your problem anyway? Oh, wait, I got it. You're here to talk about today's race. I can see it in those dopey eyes of yours. They're pleading, oh, Bruce. Can you please find it in your heart to let me win today, please? You're just desperate to win so you can get some alone time with Zelda up on the statue of the goddess at the end of the ceremony. I don't like this guy. I don't like this guy one bit. One bit. <laughs> well, sorry, pal. Bruce doesn't do charity for wimps. My advice? Work hard and wish with all your heart. You might even come in second. Say, come to think of it, how come I don't see your bird? Where is that scruffy pile of red feathers? I can't imagine what could have happened to him. Do you think his <laughs> tiny brain got confused by all the clouds and got lost? Give him back. Huh? I've got no idea what you're talking about. Yeah, you do. I just heard you. You know, we're all getting tired of how you never let anyone forget you and Zelda go way back. You've been friends since you were kids. Big deal. It doesn't change the fact that you float through life with your head in the clouds. Would you wake up, straighten up, and grow a backbone already? Dopes like you are dragging our honored academy through the mud. I hope I get to fight this guy. Zelda! Thank God. Thank God Zelda's here. Um, and just who might you be talking about, Groose? Oh? Zelda? Hey, nah, it's, uh... 
<laughs> Look at Zelda sticking up for us. Don't even try it, Bruce. You're picking on Link again, aren't you? He's a student at the academy like all of us. No. Why do you insist on bullying him around so much? Yeah, I suppose. You suppose? Suppose what? I suppose you er What happened there? I hate to say it, but I'm beginning to suspect that those blockheads had something to do with your loft wing's disappearance. Yeah, we know that for a fact at this point. Your father said he'd talk to Instructor Horwell after about delaying the start of the wing ceremony, so don't worry, we'll find your bird in time. I can't wait to jump off the edge of Skyloft and just jump on a bird. So I assume now they want me to go back? What's wrong, Link? What, your loft wing is missing? That's terrible. I was looking forward to seeing that red blur streak through the sky. I haven't seen him. Why don't you look for him by the statue of the goddess? You'll have a good view of the whole town from way up there. Okay, statue of the goddess is a great big statue in the north of Skyloft. It's all, it's at that place with the X mark. Yeah, I think it's over this way. Oh, what's he doing here? You gonna come follow me? Aww. Oh man, it's so cute. It is so cute. Oh, we got this cute little guy with us now. But I'm gonna run. What is this guy doing? Look at this thing. Who knows how long this statue's been here? It only has one eye. Poor thing. You probably know this, but you can. Oh yeah, I know that. We will go this way. Oh, he's waiting for me. Here, I'll take you. Here, we're gonna go together. I'm gonna take this guy with me. I don't think we need to. But what's he doing? Hey. Oh. Over here. I have some information about your loft wing. Come over here. I'm just gonna carry this guy around with me. <laughs> Hey, Link, I was just looking for you. I heard your loft wing has gone missing, so I thought I'd join the search. When I asked Fledge what he knew, he started acting weird. Aww. I'm sorry, Link. I really wanted to tell you, but Bruce found out I told you. But if Bruce found out, I told you. Sounds like Bruce forced him to keep quiet about it. Go on, tell him the truth. <sighs> just a little while ago, when I was cleaning the dining hall, Bruce and his buddies came in. They didn't notice I was there and started talking about their plan to hide your loft wing. I wanted to warn you, but just as I tried to sneak away, Bruce and his gang grabbed me. They said if I told you, they'd make sure I'd never be able to ride a bird ever again. It sounds like Bruce and his buddies had a plan to capture your bird and hide him near a waterfall. Well, near a waterfall would mean, quick, let's take a look at your map. Right there. I think it means the waterfall marked with the X. Okay. <clears throat> Forgive me, Link. I can't help being such a coward. I'm really sorry. I'm not mad at you, Fledge. If you're gonna waterfall, remember that there are some dangerous things there. Creepy, crawly things. You'll need to carry a sword. I think I saw the Knight Commander go into the sparring hall. Ooh. Yes. Let's get a sword. Let's get it. Let's get a sword, baby. Can I please have your sword? Egus. Egus. Hey, it's Link. So you still want to get in some sword practice, even though today's the wing ceremony? I'm impressed. Uh, the sword is in the back room. Go back there and get it. I'll be here for a while, so if there's anything you don't understand about handling a sword, go ahead and ask. Let's get the sword first, and then mess with it. Ooh. Classic. You got a practice sword. Students at the Knight Academy practice with these. It looks like it's a fairly sharp blade. Or start at any time. Okay. Hey. hey, Link. You can't take sword outside. What do you think you're doing? Sneaking out with that. Oh. No, I need to borrow it. What? Your loft wing is missing? You want to go look for it? Well, I guess I could make an exception. But remember that Skyloft is a peaceful place. Only knights carry swords. So I don't want to see you swinging it around like crazy out there. 
I don't want you to get in tons of trouble over this, so here's the deal. Make sure you get plenty of practice on the logs first, and once you get outside with that sword, only use it when absolutely have to. Got it? Yes. I understand. I understand. We will be very respectful with the sword. We will only attack people when we get attacked. Oh, like, yeah, can I hit these now? Maybe. There he is. Um, waterfall cave, beware of blood-sucking monsters. No kids allowed. Yep. There we go. There we go. Waterfall cave. Oh, this is our first time fighting enemies now. Uh-oh. Oh, they're fast. Whole universe and whole world of it. But there's more I gotta... Oh. Oh, you can do a spin move, but you run out of stana stamina. Interesting. Where's the bat? Come here. Oh, you can do it quick, too. Right, let's go out this way. Okay. There's Zelda. Hey, Link, I was hoping I'd find you here. I heard you'd gone searching for your bird around the waterfall, so I thought I'd fly around and help you look. How's your search going? Any sign of your loft wing? <sighs> oh, no. Well, let's not lose hope yet. There's a place up ahead that Groose and his gang are always hanging around. Maybe we'll find something there. Huh? Who? Who's that? Who's calling for me? Oh. Sorry, Link. I got distracted for a moment. Let's go. Oh, we get to go with... Okay, I just wanted to check, see if that was something different. We get to go with Zelda? Look, there he is. No doubt about it. That's your loft wing, Link. Deleted. Thank you for the six months with Twitch Prime. Yeah, Zelda's great. Gotta love Zelda. Especially a Zelda game that you've never played before. Like this one. That's why I'm so excited. Um, thank you, Bastion Creed. <laughs> why is the music so sick? Why is it so sick? We should hurry, Link. Now that your loft wing is free, you should fly to the ceremony. But before you go, I have to ask you something. I heard this voice a few moments ago. Did you hear it too? It's been happening a lot lately. It's the strangest feeling, almost like someone is calling out to me. Have you ever wondered what's beneath the clouds? Some say that it's an empty, barren place, or even there's nothing at all down below. But I just have this feeling that they're wrong. Some of Father's odd texts, or old texts, talk about a place called the surface. The old tales describe a whole world under there, far more vast than Skyloft. The thing is, no one's ever been down there to see it, and our loft wings won't fly through the cloud barrier. But I can't help imagining the wild things that might be waiting below. Someday I want to see for myself. Yeah, so they live in their own little world above the clouds. Oh, sorry, Link. We don't have time to talk. Let's get going. Look, your bird's waiting for you. Just leap off the edge and press down. Don't worry about falling. Your bird will catch you for sure this time. Andy, thank you for the 100 bits. Thank you very much. And Jbog, thank you for the 100. I have not played Fire Emblem. Uh... But I would like to. I do have Fire Emblem Three Houses, but I've not played it yet. Okay, I pressed it right away. Did 
Loftwing really is amazing, especially considering everything the poor guy has been through. I'm going to fly back and tell Father what happened. Oh, no. no. Here he is. Well, well, if it isn't Link. Word around the plaza is you found that dumb bird of yours. Well, that's just great, because you and your dumb bird can't tell time. All the pre-race warm-ups me and the guys did were for nothing. Now I'm all stiff. You've been waiting forever for the race to start, and they delay it for you? I don't get it. The big flake gets special treatment? <laughs> You're almost a man, and yet you still can't seem to go anywhere without Zelda. I bet you can't even decide what to have for lunch on your own, huh? And don't think we haven't noticed the smug looks. Oh, Zelda and I are best friends. We go everywhere together. Ugh. <laughs> you think you're pretty uh <laughs> You think you're pretty suave, don't you? Well, don't you? Bruce has been going on forever about how he's going to be the one to be with Zelda. He's really got his pompadour in a ruffle about her. <laughs> I hate to break it to you, but today's the day I bust up this adorable little fantasy land you're living in. Zelda's playing the role of the goddess at today's ceremony, and I'm going to be the one to claim the sailcloth. When I heard she made it herself, man, no way was I going to let some scrawny clown snatch that prize from me. Oh yes, that sailcloth, Zelda's sailcloth, will be mine. Oh man, I bet she was thinking about me when she was stitching it. Yep, I can see it now. First I win the big race, then Zelda and I finish the ceremony together on the statue. Just the two of us. It'll be our special moment alone. Nobody is stopping me and Zelda from having our moment. Oh, it's so real. I can, I can see it. <laughs> Bruce, psst, behind you. Right behind you. What? Can't you two see I'm in the middle of... And she's there again. And she's there again. Care to explain just what you meant by our special moment alone? I, uh, nothing big, really. Just, uh, just Link. Yeah, I was just telling my buddy here how glad I was he found that red bird of his. Boy, am I really looking forward to a fair race. Anyhow, later, Zelda. Look for me during the race. I'll be the one pulling off all the dangerous moves. This guy's great. This guy's amazing. <laughs> Hey, Groose, wait up. Uh, did you hear that guy? A fair race? Yeah, the chances of that happening are just about less than zero. Either way, don't let the fools get you down, Link. Just get out there and fly the best. Now you've got these guys beat deep down. I think you can do it, too. Yeah. That's the spirit. Link, trust me, you can win this. Wing ceremony is about to begin. Looks like it's race time. Good luck, Link. Here we go. It's the big race. <laughs> yeah, boy. I don't feel super confident about flying this thing yet, but we'll see. Attention please, last parade beginning the beginning of the ceremony, beginning to worry that I can see that link. No longer concerned, glad you don't make it before the start, I'll spend the... 2,000 years later. Go. Oh. Okay, where am I going? Go, go down. Oh man, I'm not flying great. Oh, 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 got him, got him, got him. Hey, don't you know this is my day to get all the glory? Oh, no. He interfered with me. We almost got it. Come on. Yeah, you heard him. Let's see how you fly with egg on your face. That's not fair. That's already interference. There we go. Come on. We are the champions. We are the champions. I think I just made myself overly nervous. We were okay. Link. I would never get used to that, by the way. Just jumping out of the sky. Don't worry, I'm fine. Great flying, Link. Congratulations. Now we'd better get on with the ceremony. They are very, like attached in this one and i love it link hand me that bird statuette you grabbed in the race i must offer it to the goddess we're gonna end up going to the land or, or we're gonna get hit with a giant yoshi egg and then fall down oh is zelda gonna sing again I 
I've never heard the Skyward Sword music, and it's so good. Great goddess, guiding light and protector of our people, grant us your blessing and mercy as I act in your steed during this ceremony. Valiant youth who grasp victory at the celebration of the bird folk, in accordance with the old ways, I now bestow the blessings of the goddess upon you. Blessings of the goddess drift down from the heavens aloft a sail, which I now pass on to you. You got the sail cloth. Now you can jump from any height without fear of a painful landing. That's incredible. Okay, so now we do kind of have like a little bit of a glide. It smells nice too. <laughs> yeah, boy. Link, quit goofing. This is supposed to be a sacred ritual, remember? You know, they say that the goddess gave the sailcloth to her chosen hero long ago. Of course, the one you're holding isn't the same one. I've been working hard to finish making this sailcloth in time to give it to today's champion. I'm really glad I got to give it to you, Link. Make sure you take good care of it, okay? We will. We will. Thanks for making it up here to do this with me today, like you promised, Link. Now we really should finish up this ritual. You do know what happens at the end, right? Nope. Really? Huh, I thought you would have figured it out by now. They're gonna she's gonna push us off the edge again. Okay, she didn't push us that time. <laughs> Finish the ceremony, you need to drop down right in the center of it. Leap off the edge here, right before you hit the ground, press ZR to open up your sailcloth. Just how brave are you? If you really are fearless, you'll wait until the last second to use your sail sailcloth. So ready to jump? She pushes us again. She is... Okay, I pressed it and then lost grip, so I'm so glad we still lift. <laughs> that was perfect. You're amazing, Link. Literally, my finger totally slipped off the button. You know, Link, seeing is how you won today. And with the weather being so nice. You think maybe you'd like to, you know, go fly around the cl clouds together? Yes, I would love that, Zelda. Something's gonna happen. I'm gonna get hit, and we're gonna fall to the ground. Link, hey Link. Today was amazing, watching you win the race and performing the ritual together. I'll always remember this. It really was wonderful. <laughs> you know, Link. There's something I've been meaning to talk to you about. And here it goes. There's something I've been meaning to talk to you about gonna get hit in the face with an egg probably not an egg but called it called it what is that what's going on Okay, so Zelda... Link. She got sucked into that tornado thing. Now we've got to rescue her. Who is this? 
I am waiting for you. The time has come for you to awaken. You are vital to a mission of great importance. Link. Ah, you're awake. Oh. oh, we're still in Skyloft. When your loft wing carried you back, you were limp and unconscious. I feared the worst. Fortunately, you don't appear to have any serious injuries. For that much, we can be grateful. Where's Zelda? <laughs> but Link, where's Zelda? Oh, no. She was with you, was she not? What's happened to my daughter? We gotta rescue her. We gotta rescue her. <laughs> A black tornado, you say? Hmm, that was no ordinary storm. <laughs> you must not push yourself. You're still recovering. Tell me, when you saw Zelda today, did anything about her seem off? No, she was great. I mean, oh, she was hearing voices. I forgot about that. I see. She was talking about the surface then. And you've been having dreams about a great mission. How interesting. Ooh. I'm sorry I was lost in thought there for a moment. It's all very strange, but I doubt there's much of a connection between these things. I'm concerned for Zelda, but so long as she's with her Loftwing, I'm sure she'll be fine. Either way, daybreak is yet to arrive. It would be very difficult to spot one girl and her bird in the dark of night. It would also be very dangerous. We're gonna go rescue her. We're gonna go rescue her. Yeah, why is the dad not more... I mean, I get... I love that he didn't take it out on Link. taking me oh this is cool this is really cool really really cool yeah okay oh the cat the cat dog raccoon thing It is so cute. Here, we're gonna go together. What? What was that? Wait, is he okay now? Aww. Oh, wait, he's not... Oh no, he's evil still. Okay, now I'll have to make it across here. There we go. Nice. Okay, they're taking me to the top. Yeah, now where are we going? This is like my favorite song so far in the game, I think. Like, I'm gonna look for this song after the stream today and download it. Oh, we got a new path now. Okay, let's go to this new area. What is this? The Inside the statue of the goddess. Are we getting the master sword? Of course, rough tornado. Of course. The one chosen by my creator. I've been waiting for you. This song is great. According to your social customs, I should provide you with my personal uh, 
designation. Phi is the name I was given. I was created for a single purpose, long before the recorded memory of your people. I must aid you in fulfilling the great destiny that is your burden to carry. Come, Link, you must take up this sword as the one chosen by my creator. It is your destiny. Are we get Master Sword right at the gate? The strange dreams troubling your sleep, my sudden appearance. Uncertainty. Sorry, it's the song. Uncertainty surrounding the fate of one you hold dear. Under the circumstances, it is only logical that you would exhibit some apprehension. And to minimize your uncertainty, allow me to share some information. My projections indicate that this information has a high probability of altering your current emotional state. The one you seek, Honorable Zelda, is still alive. <laughs> and this spirit, Maiden, the one you call Zelda, is another chosen one fated to be a part of the same great mission. Therefore, should you wish to meet with your friend, I highly recommend you take up this sword before you set out to search for her. Does that information invigorate you? Are you ready to accept this sword? <laughs> It seems that further persuasion measures will not be required. In the name of my creator, draw the sword and raise it skyward. Ah, I see what they did there. All right, I think this is the master sword. I think this is it. Oh, ready stance. different sword you got the goddess sword this mysterious sword is bathed in divine light <laughs> link Ooh. I've had my suspicions but until now I wasn't sure yet here we are in the chamber of the sword the very place where it was foretold the youth of legend would one day appear it is said that this place was left to our people by the goddess herself. Do not fear, for it is then that a youth guided by my hand shall reveal himself in a place most sacred. <laughs> it started days ago. The sword that I've kept secret all these years, it began to give off a faint otherworldly light. The youth who draws forth the guiding sword shall be known as the goddess's chosen hero, and it is he who possesses an unbreakable spirit. He shall be burdened with the task of abolishing the shadow of apocalypse from the land, such is his destiny. With the spirit of the blade at his side, he shall soar over the clouds and plummet below. I knew it. I knew we were going to the ground. And united with the spirit maiden, shall bring forth a piercing light that resurrects the land. Some of Father's old texts talk about a place called the surface. The old tales describe a whole world below, far more vast than Skyloft. Yep, that's where we're going to go do our fighting. Master, you must embark on a great journey beneath the clouds to the vast realm of the surface. It is only through this journey that you can fulfill the mission set before you by my creator, the goddess. It is also the only method available for you to reunite with the spirit maiden, Honorable Zelda. <laughs> oh. Ha! Okay, so I, I have to hold it up for a second and then tap right stick. Now we'll put the tablet in here. Oh, we need probably four pieces. I reside within your sword and will accompany you in your travels. Press down to summon me whenever you require my assistance. Oh, so this is almost like Navi from Ocarina, just...
different, obviously. Link, listen a moment. The nature of the great apocalypse mentioned in the old text is a complete mystery to me. But whatever it turns out to be, it seems that both you and Zelda have big roles to play in the destiny of this land. Just think if, what if this fee says, if what this fee says is true, Zelda is alive, alive and no doubt coming to terms with whatever it is the goddess has in store for her. Yes, dude. Oh, I know. I've heard Wind Waker is incredible. Hmm. That is Zelda. That, or that is Link. That is Link. Uh, take care on your journey and be sure to stop by some of the shops at the uh, Bazaar here in town to equip yourself properly for the travels ahead. I will return to my quarters and see if I can glean more useful information from the ancient text. May the goddess watch over and guide you both. Ooh. <laughs> that green uniform looks so adventurous. You sure look like a, a knight now. Headmaster said you're heading out to look for Zelda. You're really something else. I could never imagine myself doing what you're about to do. Put a lot of work into making this. You should take it with you. You got the adventure pouch. You can store all kinds of useful items in this handy piece of gear. Word won't do much good if you don't have a shield to protect yourself. Here, take this with you. You got a wooden shield. This light wooden shield breaks easily and can burn, so be careful with how you use it. Oh, here's one. Here's one over here. Perfect. Perfect. It was great. I feel like we got through the entire um, tutorial area. Actually, let me go back because I'm going to save and quit. Uh, Chugs Army, thank you very, very much for everything. Stream 311 was a massive success. I love you guys. I'll talk to everybody on Discord later tonight, and then hopefully I'll see you guys tomorrow. Mwah. All right, I love you, Chugs Army. Have a good one. See you soon. With Chugs, so you better follow. Know that he up, like he at the lotto. Rolling in clutch, like he at the throttle. You loving the stream, well it ain't no problem. You know that we got him. Rolling in clutch, like he at the throttle. You loving the stream, well it ain't no problem. You know that we got him.